Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Man of War back at it again with another Sun Jian Let's Play. So, I've been noticing in my uh, YouTube analytics that I'm getting a lot of new viewers, and welcome, welcome. Much appreciated for you uh, subscribing. Any subscribe, any like really helps out the channel, and I'm really trying to grow this one. Um, so, for those who don't know, I do mostly strategy games, and I'm starting to dabble in MMORPGs, and I'm probably going to do a few uh, strategy RPGs, or just maybe even RPGs in general. Um, so, if you're new here, you also don't know that I am part of a group called Dark Omens Esports. It's uh, a group of people, and uh, most of them are Twitch streamers. I am the only YouTuber as of right now. Um, I'm also dabbling a little bit in Twitch streaming. I just got started with that. Um, so the this group of guys were all about promoting each other and helping each other grow as content creators. And it's it would be really nice if you guys checked out their stuff. So if you have more of a love for strategy, obviously I, I feel grateful that you're coming to me. But at the same time, if you also like first person shooters or just online multiplayer games or competitive multiplayer, definitely check these guys out. They're really good at what they do. Um, so they'll be playing games like Rocket League or Apex Legends or Call of Duty, Mo Call of Duty Warzone. I almost said Modern Warfare there. Ooh. Um, and uh, they've been dabbling in this game also called Escape from Tarkov. It's really interesting. It's almost like a uh, survival first person shooter. It's it's pretty cool. I would definitely um, suggest checking that one out. Um, so that's it for the introduction. Let's get back into right where we were. So right now uh, we've got Sun Tzu, which is the current leader of our faction uh, going on a jungle expedition where he is potentially going to get just absolutely torn apart over here um actually did i let's let me just see I'm sorry, uh, I really don't know why my computer does that. It just randomly spikes uh, everything. Don't, doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Um, I'm pretty sure here, just hold on a minute, guys. I'm going to fix this real quick. Uh, da, da, da. Did it change back to auto fan? I really hope it didn't. Um, no, that one's manual. That one's manual. That one's automatic. That one's automatic. Okay, so I think it's just the CPU operating temperature that's doing it. I don't know what's going on with the sensor on that one, but uh doesn't make a lot of sense to me. Anyway, so I've pretty much fixed it as much as humanly possible. It's probably because this room's a little hot to be perfectly honest um yeah so he's on a jungle expedition right now he's got to take out three armies by himself and i think we can do it the only one that's really going to give us any trouble is meng huo's army uh okay so where else are all my people so huang guy is currently on a mission to uh potentially to destroy Sao Sao. I mean, Sao Sao is running away like a little coward that he is. Um, and then we've got uh, the young son moving in on uh, his territory up here, cutting him off from basically everything else. I have a feeling we're going to end up just absolutely crushing his faction because he's only got one, two... Three. I'm pretty sure that's all he's got. Yeah, he's all, oh he's got he's got five commanderies. Currently, our one army is at his faction capital. Okay, so if that's the case, let's just do some housekeeping items real quick, guys. You know, I usually take a long time doing this. <laughs> Um, 
Oh, that was probably really dumb of me to say. Oh, well, okay, so, um... Da, 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 da. Okay. So, since we're gonna bridge that, it doesn't really matter. What would I like for my guys right now? I think I was trying to get... I think I was working on the tea gardens. Either that, or I was trying to get... I have no idea what I was trying to do. It's been a while since I played this. Um, what we got here? Artisan tools. Yeah, that would be nice. Uh, what does that get me? That would help. That would help. I think that's the one we need, uh, potentially. Either that, or we can get the Imperial Sword Guard or the Pearl Dragons. Thinking that might be our ticket. Yeah. Unless we want to uh, do that. Heavy mounted archers. Hmm. 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 Is that how I get the palace? Alice is probably up here. Yeah. What do I need for that? Oh, Confucian Temple. Awesome. I need so much for that one. Hmm. I remember I just finished saying that I wasn't going to take a super long time doing this. Um, Caltrops and better cavalry. That would be nice, but I think we're just going to finish this one off first. Beauty. All right. So she's in the middle of sieging his capital. Uh, these guys are down here. I got to figure out where I'm going to put them, but let's focus on what's going on in the south so he's busy taking up all this territory down here um who are we at war with what is going on that sounds like it might be my gpu super strange that that's doing that all right so again sorry about the noise guys it's uh it's not it's kind of out of my control right now mm. so let's finish taking where am i gonna send these guys so that's the sun i nobody really likes um let's get rid of his axe band and give him something actually useful uh like the pearl dragons looks good to me yeah we'll give him two sets of pearl dragons sounds good um yeah so here's where the complications begin to arise do i have night battles i do have night battles oh this this can be easy then fight a night battle that battle that i stood no chance at is now decisive oh my goodness and let's check and see but i think i'm just gonna fight it so running joke on this uh series is this game is not total war it's how many battles can i get into in a single playthrough um each video I usually do a quick count and uh, see how many battles I get into and a lot of the time my counting is off I'll do three battles and say oh five five because everybody overestimates everything <sighs> okay so Beauty. Okay. 
So this should be relatively easy. I'm legitimately just going to put them there. Turn them on fire mode. And uh, we're kind of just going to watch everything go down. Yeah. Uh, you guys can all start in fire stance too. It should be fine. So let's just fire right into the middle of them. Uh, you, 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 and you. Let's move you guys up. We're also going to group you. I'm going to move you guys in right behind them. You guys can go like this. I don't really need my generals in this one too much. I will move them up just for... Can you please fire? Yeah, thank you. Thank you. And they basically surrendered right there. Okay, I'm gonna have him aim for the poison spears. Because they may be an issue. The enemy unit flees! Ha! What cowards! Yeah, they never really stood too much of a chance. I kind of figured that was going to happen, but let's see if we can take out their generals. Oh, no. That was that was an accident. Shameful defeat on my part, for sure, because I, I could have taken out those generals and I just didn't. Fight with utter belief. If you guys haven't seen my video um, about the five things that I really like about this game, one of the things that I didn't mention in the generals being characters as well type thing was um, just the sequence of animations like the duels and um, the after battle sequences. They look amazing. Like in China, I'm not saying this actually happened because obviously I was not there, but um, in a lot of the recreations or the fantasy recreations of this part of history you see the generals would often get split off from the group and duel each other and that seemed to be like a common thing where the soldiers would separate each other because it was a matter of honor and i don't know how true that is i mean war gets kind of crazy just in general so god whoever knows what would have actually happened there um but I'd like to think that at some point there was a time when generals could just duel each other equally without having to rely on people backstabbing them or one of their soldiers taking them out. Oh, oh okay, yeah. So his brother is dead. Consider this a mercy. And then he's probably going to run away. Now, I think the key here is going to be not exactly to run away, but to... Okay, so how much room do I have to maneuver here? Not a lot. Now, if I can run an amp... No, I don't have enough room to run an ambush. Uh, do I want to run that risk across the river? I'm kind of stuck in a bad place right now. So between these two armies, I should be able to just absolutely decimate them. Um, you know, we're going to try the same thing. We're going to line up our ranged units and then we're just going to have at them. And the reason I'm fighting these battles, even though it's guaranteeing me a victory, 
It's because we've got that huge stack on the other side. Oh, so they're coming from like way uphill. Okay, all right. Um, yeah, they've got that huge army stack just sitting there on the other side. And I don't really appreciate that, to be honest. So we're just going to let them sit there and chip away. And you, 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 and you. And I'll group up like so. Uh, yeah. Uh, you and you. You. Over here. You can come back here. You, you, and you can group up like that. Okay. Where are they coming from? Oh, they're coming from behind us. Oh, okay. Okay. So basically, what you're telling me is... Okay. So what I need to do is I've got... We've got our backs to the river here. So what I am going to do group them let's get you guys up over here and you guys plus them group those guys should be relatively easy to take care of yeah so what i actually want to do is i want to line these guys up over here and then we've got one two three four let's line you guys up over here here and then we've got group one let's turn on the fire arrows because they should not last that long under this kind of heat They're coming along. Die! I have seen greater skill from children. Beauty, okay. So let's move you guys back down slow.
warriors are running. Ah, uh, now would have been a great time. As you guys can see, I have moved my troops around to the back and I used a small force to just absolutely crush their first uh their first units. I mean sure I guess. It is fun to watch you improve. Look to your own troubles before mine. All right, we're gonna move these guys up. We're just gonna basically fold in. So let's move him in. And that's basically all she wrote. So let's do a quick zoom in for you guys. Everybody's soaked in blood. And the blood of their enemies. Come on, Chang Poo, you can do this. Ooh. Beautiful kill. Alright. And in the end, we get that decisive victory. Alright. So that's two battles. And that should be two armies down. Should be. Hmm. Yeah. I don't think any of them are going to survive, to be honest. They Two less. and three. Then we're going to probably replenish a little bit. Beauty. Naked and violent. Frustrated with an endless duel against the enemy and tired of swapping exhausted horses for fresh ones, Zuchu strips off his armor and rides back into battle naked. Okay, so that's an interesting way to gain experience, but it sounds like something he would do. Peace through right. conquest. So what I am going to do is how much room do I have left? He probably won't fall for it. But if I can just get a little bit further out, yeah, I should be able to reach him if I did that. All right, well, it should be interesting for sure. Let's see if we can get that ambush in. Um, so for him, we're trying to corner Sao Sao right now. Why? Why, computer? Why are you doing this to me today? I don't understand. I don't understand. Uh okay. So should we try to take the city and send him to an early grave or what's going on with that? So where is he right now? So he's actually right there. Is there anything I can do? Right. I could oh yeah, right. I don't have enough for the assassinate the enemy. Um <laughs> actually he'll probably help if he's still in that building when i attack it so i think that's kind of why i'm moving my way downtown 
walk in fast, bases pass, and I'm home down, and I'm home down. Okay, so um, we're gonna block off his path here. Yeah, I don't know if I really want to... Yeah, no. I don't think I want to fight this one. I'm just going to delegate that. Good planning and good luck it wasn't a bad result. So I can I can live with that. I can live with that. Oh, man. We can use a like this. Okay. And then we've got Zhu Chu, the man, the myth the legend walking that way um let's move him over to guang in the name of china uh, we're we're on our way and it's only spring so we we got time he's got some high level commanderies here how are we doing here so we've got a siege tower we got a battering ram and apparently he's only got one person left in there. So I think we're good. Why does it say continue siege? I'm pr I'm pretty sure I can I can just take his capital. Um Yeah, we're just going to delegate that. They had all of 15 soldiers in there. We lost how much two okay all right um yeah i think we're i think we're just gonna wipe him off the map because sao sao is too untrustworthy too conspicuous there's really nothing i can do with him um what do i want what do i want yeah, let's let's do that. Obey the heart. Okay, so what am I working with in this place? So I've got Temple of Grand Confucius, so that'll be good if I decide to go level something up. Um, we've got irrigated farms. I uh, could probably convert that to a community market. Wouldn't hurt. Um, let's go with tax collection because we've already got the temple there makes the most sense uh how am i doing with everybody else so yan bai who has oh wonderful just wonderful that's peace and then basla no he doesn't want peace and he definitely does not want me there at all and they want nothing to do so who is she and why do i care okay no they they don't want anything to do with me meng huo on the other hand i'm surprised he doesn't want peace with me because he actually he has quite a little swath going there and i have invaded his territory quite a bit So they are subservient to me. Glad tidings to you. Uh, so everybody, everybody would be mad at me because I just vassalized him. Okay, good to know. Good to know. Glad to see you. Uh. Yeah, no, I don't really like that idea either. Uh. No alliance. Not you again. Uh, he does not want to abdicate. How does that work? I'm pretty sure you can't do that. But hey. I haven't even met this guy yet. Uh, a non-aggression pack, perhaps? Is he at war with anybody? Interesting. I'm just trying to find some people who join my empire. 
and he's not going to want anything to do with me. So I am trading with Liu Yan. Not sure how. Regardless, I've got all this swath of territory. Now, since Cao Cao has been on a losing streak, I feel like he might be more inclined to... Uh... Your treacherous tongue is grating. So he's more likely to do peace with me. Nobody, he does not want me to vassalize him. No, okay. He just really does not like to lose. Interesting. So if he's not ready to give up to vassalization yet, and then even that guarantee of autonomy, he's still not down for it. So if he wants to fight to the end, he can fight to the end. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna force him, but uh, yeah, he's being kind of a jerk right now. Assassinate the factioner. So he's actually doing it. Who is the faction here right now? Die. Looking for the air, looking for the air. Who is? He's the general. Oh, you human. Where is she in his family tree right now? I know I'm being ridiculous right now, guys. I apologize. But where is she? Like, who is she married to in his family to make her an heir? Please explain this to me. All right. You know what? I'm not, I'm not even going to question it anymore. You do you, dude. Um... Yeah, I'm just, I'll deal with you as it, as it comes. Okay. Um, pretty sure. I'm gonna let them replenish a little bit first. And then we'll move them. I am so sorry, everyone, that my computer keeps doing this. I will try after this recording to uh, figure out what exactly is going on with that. Okay, so he's going to choose to run away. Uh, I don't really want to have to f chase him. Somebody... That's how enacted a scheme. Awesome. So he's being a jerk now. Now I might be able to attack his uh, his main settlement here. If he really wants to play this game. Mm. Oh, not what I was trying to do. Been too used to playing uh, New World right now. Okay. Uh, I'll just tell you what. Uh, oh, I can't trade territory because he doesn't have the reform for that. Okay. He's got to stop somewhere. So what I am going to do. I don't really care about all that. What I do care about is taking this guy down. So I'm actually going to chase him. Yeah. So this shouldn't be too bad. I've at least got 
a decent standing army right there. They've got better better troops, but we can make that work. Um, okay, so we've got everything going on here. My lord. Uh, can I swap him for anybody? Liu Shang, Zhou Zin. So he doesn't look too bad. Uh, don't need another one of those though. It's not terrible. We still got a few more. Uh, military supplies. Yeah, sure. Let's let's put her there. And then, yeah. There we go. We've got a spot for everybody now. We have all the things. Who is that? She's got the most magnificent armor I've ever seen. Um. Do we have any better armor for her? I mean, it wouldn't have all the minuses for sure. Yeah, that one makes more sense. And what about him? No, no, he's he's just he's not bad. Uh, okay, so where do I want you? Oh, Yang. That. What I really want right now. Let's see if he can. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. This is a ridiculous. This is going to be a ridiculous episode, guys. Here, give me uh, one quick second. All right, so I'm pretty sure um, I have a absolute, like, I don't know. It's basically a box fan beside me. Um, I managed to still keep it quiet, so it's not doing terribly. But what I'm thinking about doing right now is using this guy as the general. I'm gonna run a military revolt. I'm gonna have him turn and face and go against Sao Sao. Yup. So that's the thing I'm doing. Contemplate all. I'm gonna use him almost like a sacrificial pawn. Um. Yeah, let's apply that because That'll work in my favor. Swap. You know what, let's hold them to that unit. But what I will do is instead, I'll swap out this guy or some Pearl Dragons. Yeah, sounds good. All right, and then we're gonna run this guy that way. And then, what units does he have right now?
I don't know. Let's not extract him. Let's run them out a little bit. Uh, yeah, so they've got a decent sized army, but we're going to continue the siege. Okay, we'll figure out what to do with him after. I wonder if there's an option. Do something. Okay. Might be able to do something if he ends up attacking me. And while we're here, let's just uh, run a little upgrade scheme. So we've actually got some decently built up places. Uh, let's run that one. That one's almost done. So let's just finish that. Um, what have we got going on here? We've got Magistrate Building. I don't have enough of that. So I think I might actually end up getting rid of that. Not 100% sure yet, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to get rid of that one. Um, industry. Yeah, okay. So we're dealing in commerce and industry for the most part. I can't remember, uh, six. So that's the most buildings we have. Let's just, mm, come from commerce. Let's build the private workshop. That should actually help us out a little bit. Then let's build that guy up too. Let's use some money. Ling Ling. Ling. We're not doing a lot of trading anymore, so let's just upgrade that. Da, 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 da. Kang Wu. Let's finish clearing out Kang Wu. Then we might have to circle back around and do Ling Ling. Yeah. Sounds good to me. That was a little loud, my friend. All right. Spread in all directions. All right. So we should be good to go to our next turn. I see what that I see what they're doing. There's a lot of big battles coming up. Okay. All right, so he wants to fight me on the field of battle and he's got the high ground. Super duper interesting. That elephant unit gets me every single time. All right, so we are running out of time today, my friends. So I'm going to do this one battle for you guys, and then we're going to end it there. So whatever happens, happens.
All right, let's hop in. The Conqueror of the South finally uh, taking on one of the head Nanman tribes. It's only fitting to end it on this one. All right. So it's actually a pretty open field, I'm surprised. Uh, let's drop these guys in here. Let's actually just line these guys up. We're gonna group them like that. We're gonna group our soldiers like this. Beauty. Okay, so right against the river. Um... Let's get two and then three. We're gonna group them and then group him with them. Beauty. So I'm gonna have them run around. And then we're gonna run. Okay. I'm gonna keep him here. I'm gonna keep Cheng Pu here as well. And we're gonna have a solo unit running that way. Alright. Let's do it. So let's move our archers up. Go about there. Move our soldiers up here. You can come there. You can come there. Let's run these guys into the forest. We're gonna set the forest ablaze. The south will bow to the hand. Your rabble has no hope of the victory. Who are they firing at? Let's fire at the elephants. That is the most important part right now. Actually, yeah. troops they need to come back I have already so badly messed this up yeah, so please just keep firing on these guys actually you know what leave him leave him Don't skirmish anymore. The enemy unit bleeds. Ha! What cowards! At the ready. Beautiful. Oh, that is not a good place for them to be. Steal yourselves. Hold this. Yes. Steal yourselves. Make ready. Do not relent. Do attention. Kill them. Run, run. Move, move. Are a fool to come back. Talk all you want. You are still going to die. Run! At the ready! The Phoenix Rises! Metal! Take heed, warriors! Attack! The enemy unit flees! Ha! What cowards!
Where is Cheng Fu? Oh, I should have been paying more attention. Yeah, there we go. So this is going to be a little bit closer than I would have liked it, but it looks like uh, it's turning out okay. He's not even on a horse anymore. He's just going to run in there like a boss. Nice. Okay. And there you have it, folks. Um, so that was definitely a little bit more one-sided than I would have liked it. But we took down Meng Huo. And although Sunset did have to retreat, we, uh, we managed to figure it out. Okay. Wow, they moved super far away. How the heck does that work? Well, I'm kind of glad he returned, to be honest. Finest armor. What armor did I get? Oh, we got some more thick leather head. Okay. Da, 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 da. There is cunning in caution. Beauty. All right. So we are going to continue our chase of uh First of all. We're going to get wisdom of the river because we need that. Um we're going to continue chasing Meng Huo. I don't know if we're going to be... Oh, we should be able to reach his army. So you know what? Let's just... Hmm, not quite. Oh, we did make it. Okay. So let's just finish his army while we're here. And there we go. Fight with utter belief and you will be undefeatable. Did we capture him? Did we capture him? Did we capture him? Ah, uh, we didn't capture him. So we're going to release both of those. Alright, guys. So, thank you so much for tuning in. Uh, this is going to be it for the campaign today. As you can see, Sun Tzu is going to be uh, mopping up in the jungle. Uh, then we've got... Jiling, who did legitimately nothing this entire round. He kind of sucks. Um, we've got... Uh, um, Sun Quan, who, again, did nothing. Uh, but we're in the middle of chasing down Cao Cao. Almost there. Is it going to let me do it? Tell me. Tell me yes. Uh, not quite. All right, so that's fine. 
And we've got, we're in looking for another settlement. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Like I mentioned before, I'm going to leave all the links for all the crew on Dark Omens Esports down in the description below. Um, if you do like the video today, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe. It definitely helps out the channel. And especially when I would def when I would like to grow this, uh, I'm going to stop saying definitely now. Um, if there's anything you want me to do, like I know my five things about this game that I really liked video did fairly well. I would like to, uh, I would like to hear it in the comment section below. I want to see those comments going off. I will respond to each and every comment unless there's thousands of comments, in which case I may not have enough time in a day to do that. Um, <laughs> regardless, thank you guys so much for watching. That'll be the last time I say it and uh, have a good night.